All right, well, definitely not the, the result we wanted. I thought our kids played extremely hard. Um, we're getting better. Do I believe in moral victories? No. <laughs> but um, you can see the improvement. I thought that we really did a great job in executing for most of the game. Um, our last second uh, out of bounds things, we didn't quite get what we wanted. And we work on those all the time. But we're gonna keep working on them. Those are some things that are just tough uh, that, you know, that's when, that's when it's the nitty gritty time. Um, but, but I thought that we gave them a good, a good fight. To learn, but oh God! Like, uh, I feel a little sick right now, yeah, honestly. I would think, but, but what do you feel like your team did learn today? Let's the ask game? them. What do you guys? What did you guys learn? I feel like we learned how to fight. A lot of times, um, we'll be close in the game, and then we'll end up like just having stretches where we like will give up. But I felt like today we just kept on fighting. So that was something I was proud of the whole team about. Mm-hmm. I can definitely say I'm proud of my teammates too because you could tell we didn't give up. We kept fighting and we struggled at the beginning with giving up and they really pushed and tried to really win this game. So I can really say that's something we could learn. You know, and I think I think that uh, it's it's a tough game because nip or tuck here or there. I mean, you see the 6'5 flowers that the ball ends up in her hand and she throws up a three and <laughs> it went in. Uh, and, um, you know, we'll just – the one thing I'm really I'm, – I'm excited about that I saw was our execution was so much better. It's gotten – it's completely different from where it was uh, with Marshall and these other games, and we'll just continue – we just have to continue to execute like that. This is a team – this is a St. Louis team that just beat uh, Illinois State by seven. Um, so we're headed into conference now. I think it's, it's a, you know, obviously it would have been better had we gone in on a win. Um, but I think uh, performing the way we did shows that we can, we can do this, you know. How do you get the kind of the level of performance to smooth out over a game? Because first quarter, third quarter, really good. And we had our second, second quarter, quarter was, was tough. And fourth quarter was rough at first, and then you kind of fought your way back into it a yeah. little bit. What's, I know it's not a simple question, but what do you feel like this team needs to do to kind of achieve that, you know, consistency that when you want to see overall? Well, that's what we're that's what we work on in practice all the time because we have these ebbs and flows in practice, and they can be really high and really low. And to get the just to get a more even keel uh, consistently, that will help us. And and I keep preaching to them how important that practice is. Um, because that's what you do in a game. And they, they came back from holiday and they, they've, they've done that for the most part. Uh, and you could see that there's a difference in practice, from practice to the game. And so we just have to keep building from that. You know, um, it's, it's tough when you're young to be consistent in the clutch or when you start to get tired. Those are the moments that, that you're, you start to think about other things, you know what I mean? Or you think you, you don't have, you're not used to having to push through that. And I think we're starting to get better and better at it. What did you want in the last possession? Obviously, you needed you a, three. a three at that point, obviously. But, um, we didn't really execute the, the, the play very well, either one of them. And like you said, basketball guys weren't necessarily in your corner. I mean, that shot that you mentioned, that Flowers hit, was one that, that was a, that was a, that, that was, yeah, we, yeah. If, we, if we're going to give anyone three, it would have been her, so. For you guys as players, how are you kind of keeping your heads, trying to get through this, get better, um, as you go into conference <coughs> back Friday? Um, what, where, where's your mindset at in terms of uh, where you feel like the season is right now? Um, like, even though we lost today, like, I see a big difference in our team. So I, I'm actually kind of excited to see how we do against our conference team. I feel like we might be taking a few bumps in the beginning of the season, but I feel like 
once we get to conference, it's going to be a turnaround for us. Like, I feel like we're getting to know each other better. We're getting to play with each other better. We're executing the plays better, everything like that. So I feel like it's just going to keep getting better. Um, with me, as a leader, it's like you looking at it, you just want to keep pushing them in practice, keep pushing them to get better, keep pushing them to execute, keep pushing them to want to work hard and want to win and want to be something different than what everybody expects us to be. So it's like, with me, it's like, basically just keep pushing and being a speaker and a spokesman, keep working hard so they can see that what it, what it takes and what it looks like. Does a game like this where you come so close help you keep pushing? I mean, you're disappointed in the loss, but it's right there. Yeah, I could, yeah. It, it, look, it made me look at my team like they're getting better. Every day, every time, every practice, they're getting better. So this is definitely a team that people thought that we were going to lose to a lot by. So just to see that we lost by two, that's improvement. Vicky, uh, Friday and this trip over the weekend, uh, the Valley's obviously been outstanding this year. Uh, Illinois State, a good team. Um, what can translate from this game as you go into the conference? Well, I think it translates really well. Um, I think uh, SLU does a, a lot of the same things that uh, Illinois State's going to try to do with us. Um, so I think it's going to prepare us very well for, for that Illinois State game. Um, you know, they've got, they've got Lexi uh, Wellen, yeah, who's, who's been playing very, very well, and, and TT, who, their guard, who's been doing a very good job as well. And so, um, you know, I, I think we'll, we'll be prepared. I think one of the things that, that our players will, let, will tell you is I think we're pretty prepared for everybody we play. Um, and so we'll be prepared. We've just got to we just got to make sure that we execute our stuff. Anything else? Right. Thank you. Thanks. Thanks.